Hello everybody, Caleb Wright here from Team Domination and I'm bringing you a tutorial today on photobucket.com and how you can use this website to resize and put watermarks on your images for your eBay listings. Okay, so I'm logged into the site right now and I'm going to go to this link that says editor here in the menu bar. Then I'm going to select an image from my computer let that upload. Boom, there it is. Alright, so if you want to resize your image, this link right here, or you have your menu bar up here of things you can do to your image. Okay, all sorts of things you can do. You can resize it, you can crop it more. Uh, you put, you probably don't want to put frames on it. You put stickers, I don't know, that's interesting. I don't know, I'm, I'm just putting watermarks on and resizing an image. Okay, so if you click resize, it's going to show you how big that image is. Right now it's 640 by 427. Now, we know that if you're going to make this image now for uploading to your eBay listing, it has to be at least 500 by 500. So we can uh, just change this number here on the right to 500 and click apply. And of course, as you know, in my other photo bucket video where I teach how to put images into the description, that you make them no more than 300 width so it doesn't break mobile formatting okay but for today we're gonna go with the uh, minimum 500 on one dimension image so that this image will be uploadable to eBay okay so I'm gonna apply and there it is it's resized and then next I'm going to just hit this over arrow so we can grab text tool okay so now we got this handy little text tool here. We can click it, drag it, move it over here. Now note that this black line around it doesn't actually show when you finish. It's just a, a marker. Okay, you can double click in, and then you uh, can type whatever you want. So usually for a watermark, we put like the name of our store or something. I'm just gonna come up with something. Okay, I'm gonna put uh, Bob's Steals. 707 okay and you can uh, basically put that anywhere you want an image but a real cool feature is you can actually you can resize it by clicking in the corner where you see that little circle that I just clicked on you can resize it just by clicking there and moving it and you can even put it at an angle so you go like this Bob steals all right pop that pull that a little bit closer like right there and then we're going to hit apply. Okay, now you can change these fonts and everything. There was an option for that. Um, show you right here. You can change the font size, um, or you could add another one. See, we could, I don't know, uh, maybe you wanted to put something like maybe free shipping. You know, I don't know. Get creative if you want to do something. There you go. Boom. Okay, watermarked, apply, okay, save. Okay, now that it's saved, we can go access this. Uh, we can get this right to our computer, okay, by right-clicking, save image as, and it's going to save it to your desktop. It has kind of a weird file name here, see? So uh, once it gets to your desktop, you should you should rename that or you can rename it now if you already know uh, what keyword that you want it to be um, you can name it now let's call it a uh, vacuum cleaner okay just suppose that that's the word we were trying to rank for and then I'll save it to my desktop and, and it's as simple as that then you can take that image and you can upload it to uh, eBay and you're good to go okay now uh, this is basically a pretty handy tool if uh, you don't have like paint on your computer or you don't really like using paint and, and you wanted to use like uh, the same solution for the images that you're making for your description and for the images that you're uploading. And this is pretty handy and pretty easy and it will store all your images in your image library so you don't even have to store them on your computer. Okay. So uh, Caleb Wright here signing off with a quick tutorial on Photo Bucket and how you could use it to uh, resize your images and put watermarks on. Hope you enjoyed the training and uh, make it a great day and talk to you soon.